we've seen tremendous uh, destruction of value actually in the mining industry over the last year. On average, companies are returning minus 20 to minus 30 percent total shareholder returns. And much of that's driven by the price decreases we've seen across the, every commodity, but they're all struggling to actually control costs as well. And so most companies are shifting their agenda away from growth, away from capital expenditure, and towards productivity, you know, finding a way to sweat the current assets and the mines that they have for better returns. I think there are three main challenges that most companies face. I think the first is just an over-focus on costs. Now, I know that may sound strange because costs are important and any cost reduction program you can execute is obviously valuable, but to just focus on costs is perhaps too short-sighted. I think companies have to focus on productivity in the truest sense of the term. So volume and throughput is incredibly important. Equally focusing on capital improvements in their sustaining capital base and mine life overall, making sure you're not making short-term moves that actually destroy long-term value. I think the second challenge that most companies face is they're far too incremental in their ambition. They focus on five to 10% improvements where actually what they need to actually try and deliver uh, quite, quite fundamental step changes in their cost structures and in their uh, performance levels. And so you know, finding ways to actually step out of an incremental mindset and think about your mind set up in a quite a new way is incredibly important to try and get those step changes. And I think the third challenge that most companies face is around engaging their organization in this process. I think far too often we see it left to some business development team in the mine, two levels away from the managing director to try and execute a lot of these changes. Well, the poor team has no chance of actually succeeding in some of the changes that are needed. I mean, all the leadership has to be involved, all the site management has to be involved to actually generate the type of change that most of these companies need to see. The most is our framework and our approach to actually driving the step change improvements that I was mentioning before that the, we aim for 15 to 20% uh, uplift in value and performance of the mines through the most program. I think what it has is quite a holistic approach to a transformation. It looks at the management systems at the mine, how you actually direct, uh, manage and prioritise the scarce resources you have, be it actual capital or, or labour on the mine site. It also looks at the infrastructure itself and the way that the mine is set up and challenges uh, management to think about new ways to actually de-bottleneck and improve productivity at the mine. But the third, third point I think I'd raise is it looks at the organisational piece as well. How leadership needs to engage at the mine, how you need to motivate and send people on the mine but also how you need to train them up to actually execute the program well and sustain those performances over the long run.